Aston Villa 2-0 Newcastle, Danny Ng scores an incredible bicycle kick on his home debut before Anwar El Ghazi nets from the penalty spot to help Dean Smith's side secure three points. Aston Villa beat Newcastle 2-0 in their Premier League fixture on Saturday. Boss Dean Smith was without Ollie Watkins and Bertrand Traore for the fixture. However, he claimed three points thanks to Danny Ings and Anwar El Ghazi. Ings scored a sensational bicycle kick on his home debut to take the lead. Before El Ghazi wrapped it up by slotting home a penalty in the 62nd minute. For half an hour it was arduous for Aston Villa, the absence of Jack Grealish painfully apparent. It looked like their false start to the campaign would extend into a second weekend after an opening defeat at Watford, so poor did they begin here. But, in the form of home debutante Danny Ings, it may just be that Villa have found the man to remedy to the loss of their talisman. Dean Smith's side did not deserve to lead at halftime, but they did so because of an improvised moment of brilliance from their new £20 million striker. It was in the third minute of injury time that Villa loaded a throw into Newcastle's penalty area, where Tyrone Mings climbed higher than Jamal Lascelles. Ings, anticipating the flick, had spun into space and used that freedom to execute an audacious overhead kick for his second goal of the season. This time, however, it was far more important than his 97th-minute consolation at Watford. It set Villa on course for what proved a worthy victory, completed by Anwar El Ghazi's penalty. The win felt like a formality come the end, not that the home fans would have thought so after a torrid opening.